The challenge for us is nothing more than that, uh, to, uh, than to try and improve in where we are. And if um, it continues to be as close as we go along, then it, we might have to look at it elsewhere. But for now, it's just, for me, it's just looking at the next game, the next challenge of St Johnston. We're going to have to play well to win it. We don't think we're this and that. We know we have to play well. We have to do so much right in the game to win the game. Um, but we really, uh, for us, it's just to try to keep that consistency. Is it, is it difficult because fans will want to buy into this now? It is very close at, at the turn of the year. But you also have to not get carried away as well. Yeah, I, I totally get that though. You know, I think everybody the, right across you know, the media and the Scottish football, whatever, they would all love to see a chance to Celtic come from one of the other teams. And, and I think, obviously, with Dundee United, Inverness, Hamilton, and ourselves being up there, then everybody's probably hoping uh, that this somebody's going to come out of that pack, or at least a couple. So um, I understand our supporters being excited about their team and uh, relishing the opportunity, and quite rightly so. There's nothing wrong with that. But for us as professionals, you know, I said it, and I'm no, uh, obviously just trying to not get excited about it. I'm happy with my team at the minute. I'm really happy where we are, you know, and that has to be said. But as professionals, we've just got to look at the next game.